Hello and welcome to Calagram Market, our daily program on Nifty, Bank Nifty and Dollar Analysis. Um, without further ado, let's get to yesterday's analysis and see what we did. So yesterday we said that <clears throat> trying 18100 put on dips today might be a good idea because we ex expected <clears throat> bullish price action with 18100 as a support, right? Yes, it was true that PCR was always overbought. But to put things in perspective, despite US cracking down 2%, Nifty was stable at only half a percent down or something. So 18100 held. This trying to sell 18100 put on dip for expiry play worked. The call spreads or something or uh, which we did long time back also might have worked well. Bull put spreads would have worked well, which was the analysis on 16th chat. Um, so all in all, a decent expiry. If you have been a put seller, right? Now let's look at today's market. See, Nifty is above 18,000, but there is a bearish Harami cross on daily charts. Right? One second, we just see the comments to see if audio and all is correct. Yeah, so don't check. Thank you, Dave. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, so Nifty above 18,000 spot and bullish, bearish Harami cross, but on daily charts. This is mixed signals. Now let's look at Bank Nifty. Bank Nifty is forming a doji. I can't really call it a harami, but it's an indecision candle doji. Let's look at weekly analysis, right? Because tomorrow is the close of a week. On weeklies, we have formed a so this is good on a weekly time frame because Nifty formed a bullish Harami cross and gave a confirmation candle, which is a <coughs> bullish hammer now. So bullish hammer confirming a bullish Harami cross on weekly. Bullish Harami followed by bullish hammer on weekly. That is uh, uh, that is of course bullish. And let's look at Bank Nifty Weekly. This is tricky. There is a huge rejection week here. So tomorrow, if we get a bullish price action, it can form a bullish hammer again, confirming the Harami cross, right? So tomorrow's candle in Bank Nifty becomes very important. Please, please keep a close eye. Bank Nifty can form a can form a bullish hammer on weekly if tomorrow positive, which can mean bullish price action again, right? So, so daily indecision, weekly poised for a potential up move. Let's look at option charts for monthly. Because the next expiry is, of course, monthly expiry. Uh, lots of calls added. But 18,000 is a big support, right? So today there was a lot of calls added. But 18,000 pay puts, 18,100 pay puts were also added. 18,000 pay puts were also added. <clears throat> PCR is one which is very strong. So 18,000 is a support. Uh, PCR is one which is bullish of course now let's look at and there's no resistance as strong as 18,000 right so that too also we have to give credits and today despite negative price action we didn't see unwind at 18,000 put which is also a strong signal uh, overall it looks option chain looks good but this is tricky because FIIs got out of call puts both because this is expiry data but as of now there are way more puts outstanding than calls but again we have to take it with a pinch of salt why because today a lot of unwinding happened on the last day index futures 400 crores uh sell that is clearly negative but they bought 400 crores stocks uh, that is insignificant so expiry day uh data not very reliable futures data 400 cr sell mildly bearish and stock data 400 CR by uh, 
irrelevant, right? Because what do you have to say about long term? So my verdict is this, right? As long as Nifty stays above 18,000, there is a bull case. And I don't want to bet too big now uh, by paying premium because budget is also coming. So maybe Nifty might right, stay here. There might not be much, much movement before budget, right? Uh, may not, maybe a range play before budget. And because I have an 18,000 ka support and I'm expecting a range play, my favorite trade would be bull put spreads with sell leg at 18,000. Why? Because I'll keep on collecting premium. It's a peaceful trade to do. Uh, I don't expect Nifty to move much and I, th I think 18,000 is a support. All of this put together, I'll stick around at around bull spread. I don't want to do call spreads because I'll pay premium and if Nifty stays range bound, I'll lose all the premium. I don't want to do futures because it is too much for tension. So basically, bull put spread is a decent idea to do. Uh, now, let's see. Uh, you know, let's quickly look at, yeah, uh, as Arjun is saying, ultimately he's saying so, jau, fall to basic you waste karna hai. But, uh, yeah, Murtasa, your understanding is correct. But, you know, I have actually used, so Murtasa is asking, what is charm? It's Delta DK. Yeah, but the problem is this, right? Like, I have actually traded charm, right? I used to trade exotic options for uh, currencies, knock in, knock out, all sorts of, but yeah, this is not money, yaar. Paisa, directionality, or support resistance this uh, very um, uh, advanced strategies and all maths se yaar paisa nahi banta yaar maths se paisa banta to i would be very rich i would be very honest right so I, I i like i i don't know if i am a good trader or not but i am really good at math so i don't think math makes you money man like because if you know math really made money my background would have been monaco but it's not so <laughs> And finally, going to dollar rupee. The dollar rupee, our trade is working very well. We said that 8180 is a good chance to sell, and it has uh, taken resistance under this trend line, under this 100 EMA, etc. And it is correcting now. So basically, net net, my thought process is 18,000 is a support. I don't think that is going to break. I don't think before budget a big move might come. Therefore, sell put spreads and collect premium. Budget ke time pe we'll figure out. Uh, uh, what is happening? Priyadarshan is asking my PNL. PNL, mere bhai, Priyadarshan, go to verified PNL. I share it every day just for transparency's sake. Right? So, net net, in bag nifty and nifty, I'll do bull put spreads and collect premium indefinitely till clarity emerges on budget. And in dollar, I'll stay short. Right? So, this is our analysis for today. We'll see you again tomorrow uh, on Sunday with, uh, you know, expiry uh, next week's uh, analysis. Uh, till then, as usual, no advice, no tips, no recommendations, only analysis so that you can do it yourself without coming to this every day. Uh, so Arjun is asking, how do you trade budget? Yeah, trade nahi karne ka budget. That is the answer. Uh, uh, Fintu is asking, why not calendar spread till end of budget? I somehow mentally am more attuned to, if you want to do that, you can do that, of course. Uh, but anyway, that is our analysis for today. We'll see you again on Sunday. Thank you so much for joining. As usual, most important thing is bed sizing, right psychology and keeping your capital safe. So till we meet again, take care, good night and keep your capital safe. Bye.